What's going on guys? Johnny Bubbles back with another how to clean video. This time guys, it's something that's come highly, highly requested by you guys and that is a pair of soccer cleats. And the cleat that we're gonna be cleaning today are these Nike Mercurios that are in a fire colorway. Now, I don't play soccer, but if I did, these are definitely a pair that I would definitely wanna pick up. Now, I know they're not looking in the best shape, but I am gonna go ahead and clean these up, guys, with Reshuvenator's Advanced 3 Brush Sneaker Laundry System and Sneaker Laundry Detergent that is available at Reshuvenator.com, guys. So without further ado, let's get bubbly. All right, guys, for this video, I am only gonna be cleaning the right shoe. So I'm gonna put the left one down here to show a before and after afterwards. <laughs> All right, guys, so the first step is remove the laces. All right, guys, now that the laces are removed, next step is to grab our adjustable shoe tree and adjust it to size. These are a size, let me see here, size is that size nine so it's gonna be probably about the sixth hole up like here in the middle let's go ahead and try that out not that the shoe tree is inserted guys what that shoe tree is gonna help me do is apply pressure on this toe box now this shoe doesn't really crease that much because of the material but in most cases whenever you use a shoe tree it's gonna help reduce the creasing as well so now I'm just gonna grab our solution here, pour a couple small squirts, and then I'm gonna start cleaning the uppers using the soft bristle brush. All right guys, go ahead and check that out. I am done using the soft bristle brush on the uppers. And as you can see, they cleaned up really good with just that soft bristle brush. Now, I do wanna point out a couple things. Not sure how well you're gonna see it on camera, but this mesh area here is looking a little dingy. And the reason that is, is because anytime you clean any mesh material, if you just try to scrub it, it's just gonna push dirt deeper into the netting. So you really need that laundry system to go ahead, flush it all out, pull it out out. And then when it dries, make sure it dries properly as well so it doesn't leave any water stains. But that should clear, clean up to like its white natural look or what I believe was white before. And also these stains here. Now, grass stains are super tricky. Um, in most cases, they do tend to stain and don't come out. So what I would recommend is if you do play a sport like soccer or whatever you need cleats for, if you want to keep them clean, clean them after every game, every practice to avoid having these stains. But I'm gonna go ahead and move on to the outsole using the stiff bristle brush. And then I'm gonna go back to the uppers and try using the medium brush to get some of the deeper stains out, like on this back heel right here. So let's go ahead and knock that out now. There it is guys, outsole is all done, hit up and clean. Now I still wanna point out that there is a lot of like those green stains from the grass, which I'm not sure if the laundry system will get out, but I'm not too worried about it. Now to move on to the upper here on this mesh material, like I said, I am gonna use the medium brush to get some of the deeper stains out on this back heel here and on this little crease that it has right here as well. There it is guys, I am done cleaning the entire shoe. The uppers look great, the bottoms look great. I'm excited to see what they look like when they come out of the wash. But now guys, the next step is to grab our shoelaces here. We're gonna go ahead and just dip them in our bowl of solution and water. Get them all nice and soapy. And then rub them in between our hands.
All right, guys, next up is to grab our sneaker laundry bag. I'm gonna go ahead and just open it up like so. Put the shoe in, lock it up. You wanna make sure you lock it in pretty good so that way the shoelaces don't come out. What I like to do is, if I am cleaning a smaller shoe like this one, it's the size nine. So as you can see, there's plenty of like slack here. I like to just tie these together. Boom. Now let's go put these in the wash. All right guys, let's go ahead and put this soccer cleat in the wash. First step, grab your sneaker laundry detergent, and loosen the cap. You're gonna squeeze all the way up to about an ounce, right there, it's a little line right here. Go ahead and put that in your little detergent tray. Close it up. Now the settings you wanna use, guys, it's gonna be a normal cycle cold water. Never delicate. Go ahead and get that full rinse out. Boom, and we'll be back. All right, guys, we are back. As you can see, these Mercurios cleaned up really, really nice. Now, one thing I do wanna point out, guys, and I mentioned this earlier in the video was the grass stains. Unfortunately, that's just what happens with grass. Anytime grass gets on like any material, especially white, and it stays there for a while, it's gonna stain, and that's unfortunate. But overall, I am super satisfied with this cleaning. I mean, you can see before and after, even that uh, grass stain, it definitely lightened up so it's not as bad as it was before but overall it looks really really good and remember guys i was able to achieve these results with rejuvenators advanced three brush sneaker laundry system and sneaker laundry detergent that is available at rejuvenator.com but that's going to wrap up today's video guys go ahead and leave me a comment below what shoe haven't we cleaned as you mentioned this was one that was highly requested um, to clean some cleats we went with soccer ones but let me know what shoe haven't we cleaned or you haven't seen on our on our channel and maybe we'll go ahead and choose that so go ahead and leave me a comment below i'm johnny bubbles i'll see you guys next time peace